Right, so I'm going to connect. I'm going to connect the ground to the negative in the battery charger. Go, go. There, and then onto the rail. So the negative one is in there, and then a negative rail. I have a new cable in there. It's best to twist these wires so they don't unravel. And soldering time. Uh, hey, when that happens, the solder goes in. ground is in so I've now connected the ground to the battery in, in minus now I'm gonna have to now create a smaller connection to the switch so here's the switch now that needs to be connected to um, the positive which will then connect to um, this board here so maybe we can just connect the cable for the switch first so, so in the switch I'm going to have The middle, there's three pins here. The middle one is going to connect to the positive terminal, which will go into the positive rail. That's going to go in here in the positive rail. So. Okay. Oh, it's a bit fiddly, isn't it? Ah, 
I'm doing the wrong way around. I was wondering what's going on. Right, so we have a switch connected to a positive rail. Now this switch needs to connect to here. But I need a really short cable so it fits into here quite nicely. So I may have to play around with this. So this cable So have this cable going through here. And where's the switch gone? The switch. Ooh. So we already made a mistake. The switch needs to go on the outside, so I need to take this off. Now the switch goes on the outside, and the cables go on the inside. So before I do that, I should really connect um, the switch to the charger. Now I'm going to do that. I need some cable. Roughly, that'll be quite short. Quite a short piece of cable. It's getting a bit messy now, but let's um, see. Hopefully, you're keeping up. If not, you can play it back and try and make sense of all the cabling. But the schematics will give you big help. This is not okay. So now the short cable is in the plus, in plus, that's going to go into a, a switch. Switch on the outside. And this needs to go into that. Just put the cable in first and then I have to place the wire through so board in wire through the other cable on the other side I'm gonna solder this onto the first 
terminal and the switch. Right, I'm going to show you guys in a sec. There you go. Got three terminals. One, two, three. First one is for the is coming from the charging unit into that hole there, the first one. Now we're going to get the other side, which is this. The positive, remember the positive that we put on put onto this um, the the positive line here. So we're going to put that in. That's also going to come in as it would. Feed it through. It's going to be a bit more trickier because we've got solder on the thing. Maybe I should take the solder off. Just make sure these two don't touch. Just making sure. Maybe need mm -hmm. a bit more solder. Okay. Switch is done. It's all in place now. Everything is now in its rightful place. So if I switch it on, more power. Let's try it. Let's try plugging it into the main. Green key will need to come out side. So it's working fine as you can see. I've connected connected it to the charging unit. Arduino's on. The Bluetooth module's on and the screen is on. So you have a complete circuit now and I'm going to put this in to the case and um, show you guys in a sec. Right, there you guys, so I've got the um, components all in, everything's inside here, all the wiring's in, battery pack, everything's in. I'm going to now glue everything down like the screen, like the battery pack, and yeah, I'll show you the final part of it and how it's looking.